Hi, I'm Giovanni, Chef Ristorante Caserna. Welcome back. Today we're gonna prepare uh, a linguine with gambas, with, uh, with gamberi. Uh, for this recipe, we're gonna need uh, linguine, cognac, garlic, cherry tomato, parsley, the gamba, of course. This one uh, you can find it on the market. And zafran. This is also something really important, an ingredient. It's gonna give a nice touch to it. Okay, we start. Uh, we start the preparation with the cleaning of the gambas. So we take them, take out the head. We need to keep the head because we're gonna use it for uh, the taste. Clean the rest of the gamba, shrimp. Hold in the tail and taking out the shell. Inside, here, there is a part of the organs, so it's always better to take them out because they're gonna be bitter to the preparation. Voila, The gambas are clean. Uh, of the five gambas, here we have the tails. And from the five, we're gonna use just three of the head. We're preheating the pan. Put a bit of oil inside. A bit there. Garlic. We smash it. We prepare it and we leave it on the side. We are not gonna start with that one. When the pan is hot, we're gonna start with the head. Now the, the head now are gonna, are gonna bake in the pan. We're gonna caramelize the sugar, we're gonna caramelize it, and we're gonna add the taste of the gambas to our sauce. That's something that we're gonna, it's gonna give a lot of taste to it. In the meantime, that is cooking, we prepare our tomato, already cut it. So then after we're gonna add it to the, to the sauce. As you see, they're starting to change color. They're gonna become a bit more white or red. It depends which gamba you have, but it's gonna change color. Put inside the garlic. I always add a bit of oil because you cool down the, the, the temperature. And anyway, the bit of oil is gonna be in the gamba after we take it away, so it's not gonna be too fatty. At this point, it's gonna come out a really beautiful smell. You're gonna, you're gonna smell it immediately. Now, we have the garlic. The garlic is a bit, uh, is a bit baked. The head are nice caramelized. At this point, okay, we're gonna have a lot of sugars that are gonna stay sticky in the fry pan under. Now, that is the taste that we have to take out. And for taking out, we're gonna create a thermos shock with the cognac, which is gonna add also a beautiful taste to it. Be generous with the cognac. It's really important that the alcohol is totally evaporated. So we are gonna let, the, let go this one till all the liquid is actually gone, okay? After, I'm gonna add all the rest, step by step. At this point, you see that it's everything reduced. It's gonna, you're gonna see that the head of the gamba is gonna be a bit like glass, glass a bit, bit glass. Um, we're gonna add tomato, a bit of the water, and the saffron. Now we just let it cook for a while, so then uh, the water is gonna take out all the taste uh, of, uh, of the head of the gambas. After uh, two, three minutes that is cooking, we can take out the head of the gambas. I'm not throwing it on the floor, I have a step bag, a garbage bag here. And also the garlic can go at this point. Now here we have the sauce.
I'm gonna add to it a bit of the of the parsley just for a start to, the, to add a bit with it immediately the, the the taste of it. A little bit of oil again, raw. And this one is ready, we leave it on the side. When the water is boiling, we salt it and we put the pasta in. Now we keep checking the pasta. When we see that the pasta is almost cooked but it's still a bit raw, we finish the cooking process in the frying pan, in the sauce. So the meal is gonna come out and it's gonna make a bit more creamy now our sauce. Now here at this point, the pasta is cooking in its own water with the sauce. It's the time to add the shrimps, the tail of the shrimps that we cleaned before. We add it now because uh, we are gonna let cook the shrimps only with the with the with the heat of the of the pasta itself. So we are not gonna overcook it, but it's gonna be just softly cooked. It's gonna be more uh, soft in the mouth also. Now here the pasta is actually ready. We have a nice sauce. We add the last part of parsley. And we're gonna plate it. Be generous with the portion. Linguine e gamberi, buon appetito!